Oh, nice sky wheelie, big air. Oh, into a slap wheelie, into an endo. Oh, nice front wheelie. Nice, man, that was an awesome way to start. I can't talk while I'm doing all these cool tricks. Hello and welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Two Can Plays Monster Jam Steel Titans. And today we are back in our stadium championship series on New Game Plus. And we're playing as Zombie Fire today. We're gonna be going against Earthshaker. I'm so excited about this. We're gonna do some head-to-head. -head. We're starting off in Anaheim, California. Three, two, one, go! Oh, I was so early. I need to get back into the scheme of things here. I've been playing a lot of BMNG lately. I haven't been playing too much Steel Titans. So I definitely need to get back into the swing of things. This is definitely one of my more favorite tracks, not just because my mother-in-law used to work here at Anaheim, but also because it's a good track. Oh boy, here we go. Yeah, my mother-in-law used to work at Anaheim Stadium. She used to give out, or she used to sell hot dogs up in the stands. And she said that the, uh, the monster trucks were so loud. <laughs> Oh man, I'm gonna miss my mother-in-law. She passed recently. All right, two can play. Zombie is taking out Earth Shaker. Who are we gonna go up against next? We're gonna be going against the venerable Doomsday. Who are we gonna go against in the finals? Let's see. We got Grave Digger the Legend, and we've got Whiplash. I'm gonna say Grave Digger the Legend is probably gonna the one who's gonna be in the finals. Let's find out, shall we? There's Zombie. So as of recording this, Halloween has not happened yet. So this is spooky week. Oh, this is going to be good. We've got uh, Doomsday, Darth Vader, Mysterious, Dark and Scary. And we've got Zombie. First spooky week. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, man, so early. Sheesh. I'm definitely, definitely off my game when it comes to starting this. Oh, this out. Getting, getting my uh, perfect starts here. I need to get back in the game. Come on, zombie, let's go. So, Monster Jam recently came to town just a couple weeks ago, and it looked like Son of a Digger ran away with the whole show in Arlington, Texas. And I'm so sad that I missed it because Son of a Digger is one of my favorite trucks. It's my son's favorite truck. And it looks like it would have been a great show to have attended. And I'm sad that I missed it. It's just, you know, for us all to go to a show, it's so expensive, and I'm just not making enough money on YouTube yet. Oh, man. First place, moving on. Zombie, I am the best zombie driver there is. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. All right, we've taken out Grave Digger. We're moving on to Grave Digger the Legend. I was correct. Here we go, final round. Anaheim, head to head. We got the fireworks show going. Kaboom! <laughs> hey, do me a huge favor though. Before we get going, smash that like button. It really does help get these videos out to more people. It lets me know that I'm doing a good job and that you want to see more Monster Jam Steel Titans action. And here we go against Grave Digger the Legend. Three, two, one, go. Nice. Finally got that perfect start. Oh, yeah, baby. Come on, here we go. So, you know, like I said, I've been playing a lot of Beam MG Drive lately, and I really, really would like a way for the AI to race against the AI in a, on a regular racetrack, but it's, it's hard to get the AI because they don't know how to drive the monster trucks. <laughs> so, because, I don't know, it's complicated. Basically, I just cannot get the AI to work driving the monster trucks correctly because they don't know how to brake and they don't know how to uh, shift gears. Uh, so, yeah, it's if you guys know of a way to get the AI to work in Beam NG with driving the monster trucks, let me know in the comments below. I would really like to know how to do it. Uh, but otherwise, you know, we still have Steel Titans. <laughs> 
your Toucan Plays in Anaheim is your racing champion. Oh yeah, and we got a first place bonus chassis level five. That's awesome, I love it when I get an upgrade, especially that big of an upgrade, that's worth a lot of tokens right there. All right, we are off to a great start here in Anaheim. Now next up, two wheel skills. This is our stadium championship series in the new game plus. And there's zombie fire. Oh, man. If you haven't checked out my unboxing video of uh, the the truck, the trucks, the, the mystery box that K and James TV sent me. Oh, nice guy. Wheelie big air. Oh, into a slap wheelie into an endo. Oh, nice front wheelie. Nice, man, that was an awesome way to start. I can't talk while I'm doing all these cool tricks. Let's get another one. Big air, sky wheelie, another big air. How did I get two big airs? Oh, come on, come on, come on. Don't you flip on me now. Ah. <laughs> hey, we got it, we got first place. These two wheel skills are so short. <laughs> okay, that was pretty awesome. The first combo set of combos was awesome. The second set, maybe not so much. I kind of flopped it there, but hey, I got such a big combo that first time that I got first place. And this time I only got a little bit of a bonus, but that's okay. Got first place. Moving on to our final event in Anaheim, the, the time destruction. As I was saying, if you haven't checked out my toy review unboxing of the mystery box that K and James TV sent me, I also unboxed the uh, zombie fire monster truck. Three, two, one, go! In a 124th scale, and that was uh, really cool. That's probably my favorite of the 124ths that I've gotten so far. Oh, that's it. And I missed it. I only got a 20 times combo on that. That's okay. 20 times combo is doable as long as I don't crash. Whoa, there we go. Okay, okay, come on, come on, come on. We gotta find more things to smash. There's gotta be a better place. Where can I go? Oh, whoa, into the crowd, crowd killer. <laughs> Didn't quite make it all the way. There was an invisible wall preventing me from jumping into the crowd. I actually didn't even mean to do that. It just kind of, it just kind of happened. Okay, we are in third place. We gotta get, we gotta get some more here. Come on, there we go. Now we're talking. Lots of porta potties. Let's get some more. Oh, only a 14 times combo. We'll crush the car. Ah, oh, eight times combo. There's just, there's lots of stuff to smash, but it's all spread out. Two times buses. There's a whole bunch of porta potties there. Another crate, another car. But those cars, those crush cars, damn man, I, I've already talked so much about how much I hate crush cars in this game. Oh, nice, 18 times combo, 20 times combo. Oh, and that's all I got, but it was enough to put me in first place. Whew, all right, good. And 11 times combo. So everything else we do from here on out is just kind of for fun. We'll crush the buses again. Crush the buses. Whoa, a little bit of a corkscrew. Not quite. There we go. Got it. Let's see if we can uh, bust up these oh, box trucks. We got all three of them that were left. Whoa, little pirouette going on there. Nice. Got the bus too. Got three times trailers and the buses. Let's see if we can get some of these. Whoa, that was a huge air, <laughs> huge air, but we only got one blimp. Um, geez, another front flip. That was awesome. And they didn't count it, of course. Well, cause they're only counting stuff that I crush, I guess. Ah, no, 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 come on, get upright. Don't turtle, don't turtle. There we go, okay, got it. Okay, so we got a two times combo, three times. This is gonna be our last little combo attempt. 15 times combo, not too bad. 16, 18, nice. Got a little extra points there at the very end. I will take all that. Very cool, very cool. Yeah, buddy. First place. Did I get a nice bonus? Yeah, we just got a little bit of extra bonus upgrade tokens, but I'll take it. Ooh, looks like first up, we're gonna be going against Soldier Fortune. One of my favorite trucks. Also happens to be the other truck that I unlocked. Unlocked? Unboxed in that video that I referenced earlier. This is cool. This is basically the uh, the two trucks that I uh, unboxed during my, my ugh, during my unboxing video the other day. My, the two 124 scale trucks. Three, two, one, and go! Nice, perfect start. 
Well, that's kind of funny. This basically is the matchup that I uh, that I have in that video that I'm going to put up in the top right corner. Well, I had already put it up. Anyway, I'll stop talking now. <laughs> okay, I'm slightly ahead of Soldier Fortune, but I need, to, I need to speed it up just a little bit. Otherwise, I'm going to fall behind. Oh, we're not doing too bad, actually. Oh, yeah. So this course is basically just a big donut. And we are catching up where I've only upgraded zombie fire here to a tier four on everything, which seems to be enough. Even here in New Game Plus, where things are supposed to be harder, I'm still able to keep up even in tier, tier four. So we're doing pretty darn good. Very nice, very nice. So we took out Soldier Fortune. Next, we're gonna be going against Whiplash, and I'm gonna guess it's gonna be Gravedigger the Legend in the finals yet again. Let's see. All right, next up, Zombie versus Whiplash. Zombie Fire versus Whiplash. I love Zombie Fire. I really like Whiplash too. You know, it's one of my favorite trucks. Not too popular on the circuit, I know, but uh, eh, what can I say? It's got a special place in my heart. Three, two, one, and go! Just a good start. Oh, and it's showing. She is ahead. Whiplash is in the lead. I gotta catch up. I gotta catch up. Come on. Not too much drift. A little bit of drift is okay, but too much drift and you lose a lot of speed. Yeah, come on. Here we go. So we're about neck and neck even here, but I gotta get a little bit ahead. Ooh, okay. So now I'm a little bit ahead. Yeah, you can see my yellow bar is in the lead. I lost some speed there on that turn, though. A little too much drift. A little too much drift. But we did it. We caught up, and we are victorious. Yeah! <laughs> very cool, very cool. So two campaigns in Zombie Fire moves on to the finals against Gravedigger the Legend. No big shocker there. Let's move on. All right, here we go in Atlanta Zombie Fire. That's focusing right on the uh, sponsor plates. <laughs> and there's Gravedigger the Legend. Also a really cool truck. I like Gravedigger the Legend. I wish it was still running. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, and... Oh, such an early start. <laughs> oh, man. I jumped the gun a little bit. I was kind of paying attention to something. Else. I was thinking about something else. Oh, I clipped that crush car. Made that turn a little too sharp. And I made that turn a little too wide. Too much drift. But we're doing okay. We're actually slightly ahead. We gotta pull out even further in the lead if we wanna win this. Nice. We'll spray those other muscle trucks with a little bit of mud as we come around the corner. Hey guys, here, have some dirt in your face. <laughs> we are playing on hard, and like I said, this is new game plus mode, so everything should be a little bit harder. It's worth a little bit more XP, a little bit more, not XP. In this game, they don't have XP, but they've got those uh, upgrade tokens. So everything should be worth a little bit more upgrade tokens this time around. All right. Toucan Blaze is your Atlanta head-to-head -head racing champion. Nice. And I got another upgrade, free upgrade. That's always good when you get those free upgrades, especially to tier five. <laughs> Suspension level five. Nice. All right, moving on. Atlanta Time Destruction. We're going to take care of Time Destruction first, and then I think we're going to do a freestyle after that, which would be nice. Looks like there's plenty of stuff to smash here in Atlanta. Zombies' arms are out, ready to do some smashing. Oh, hey, we get the uh, orange tires this time around. Usually, I don't think we get the orange tires, do we? Maybe in Time Destruction we do. I don't remember. Yes, yeah, we did last time. We did get the orange tires. That's kind of a neat little uh, addition. Neat little trick. Whoa, straight up got a 24 times combo. That's pretty darn good, actually. We're only in eighth place. We got to get that again. Oh, man, 21 times combo that time. We're going to come around the corner, though, and we're going to get this. Very good, very good. 31 times combo. I will take that. 32. Oh, man, and that's where it stopped. Okay, let's see if we can get a nice big combo off of this jump right here. Whoa! We got a 19 times combo off of that, and then a 9 times combo. So we're in second place right now. Whoa! We're going to jump right into Whiplash here. Oh, sorry, Whiplash. I'm so sorry. Let me get out of your way. 
Okay, so we're in second place. We need to get we need to get a lot more points here. If we want to get into first, I see another series of chicken boxes up here, some chicken crates. I know I've been uh, corrected before saying oh, these are just crates, but they they are crates, but they look like egg crates that that you would put chicken eggs in. Oh man, not enough to put me in first place. I am running out of things to crush here, guys. I'm running out of things to crush. What can I crush? There's nothing left. There's nothing left to crush. Oh, there's a few more chicken boxes. And there's a car. But those cars, they don't work. Man, uh, I needed to keep that combo up going for a little bit longer. Because now I've got nothing left to crush and I've got... I've got 12 seconds left. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, man. Yeah, that's that's going to do it. I think I'm going to be stuck in second place. That is a big bummer. Oh, well, that's OK. We're far enough ahead in the lead. I don't think it's going to matter all that much. All right, here we go. Moving on Atlanta freestyle. This is where we uh, make up all of our points here. Want to get some nice big combos going here in the freestyle arena. Zombie. <laughs> Three, two, one, and go. Nice. Nice little power wheelie to start things off. Didn't count though, of course. Nice little beacon. There's another power. I keep getting all these power wheelies that don't count. I guess they're not big enough wheelies. Oh, come on, get up. Oh, whoa. <laughs> All right, there's a good power out. Are they going to count it? Yes, but they're going to count it in a new combo, of course. There we go. Nice little beacon. Let's see if we can hit the tires. Whoa, nice little butt kicker right there <laughs> into a wheelie, into a bicycle. Oh, I love this. That's great. That was great. Whoa, what in the world? How many backflips was that? Three times backflips? Jeez, into a beacon, into what in the world? Into a stoppy. You gotta love the physics in this game, boys. <laughs> Let's hit the eight pack and uh, get a nice little corkscrew out of it. Interesting, interesting. Oh, I was trying to go for a nice little stoppy there. It did not give it to me. What? You know, okay, so the power in this game is, is a little um, inconsistent. Either I'm not going fast enough or I'm just going way too fast. Okay, here we go. Let's get another backflip off the backflip container. Oh, almost made it a double. Didn't quite though. Let's see, we've got the combo still. Now, in Steel Titans 1, oh, <laughs> no. I was just about to say, it's really easy to get backflips off the backflip container. I don't like that they reset you right there at the same spot where you flipped. Come on, let's get a nice big, Big air. Very good. Very good. We'll get another one over the pod. We'll pick up that beacon. There's my stopping that I was looking for. Oh, into a nice little moonwalk, but they didn't count it, of course. Whoa, nice backflip. They, they didn't count. OK, come on. No, only got second place. Oh, man. If they would have counted that last power out, I think I would have been OK, but they didn't. That's OK, though. We are at 82 points, which is uh, what? Seven points ahead of Gravedigger the Legend. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right, let's go ahead and finish off our video, though, with an outdoor race. This is Fossil Ridge. It's a waypoint race. I do like these waypoint races in Steel Titans 1. They're kind of fun. I like the scenery in, in Steel Titans 1. I don't know. What can I say? I like that, that they're nice and bright and you can see where you're going. <laughs> We've got some pretty decent competition here. El Toro Loco Yellow, Max D, Whiplash, Earthshaker, and Pirates, or Captain's Curse, rather. Three, two, one, go. Oh, just a good start. No boosts in Steel Titans 1, so I can't boost out ahead of everybody. We are playing on hard. Just a quick play match. The AI always, it, it's very predictable in this game. You know, uh, the original Pac-Man, I'm, I'm relating Steel Titans to Pac-Man. I know it's kind of weird, but uh, the, they, there are people who are just so good at recognizing patterns and uh, oh, recognizing what the computer can do that they just get so good at Pac-Man. It's kind of the same thing with Steel Titans. Like the AI is just so 
uh, predictable that you can kind of tell exactly what they're going to do. You know exactly the path that they're going to take, and they're they're kind of easy. Even on hard, they're kind of easy. The only way, oh, dude. <laughs> The only way that the AI can really win is if you make a big mistake like that. <laughs> oh, Earthshaker's right on my tail. Or, you know, the other way that the AI can win is if they cheat, uh, which they do from time to time. Not in st necessarily in Steel Titans 1, but uh, I've noticed in other games that they kind of let the, the uh, AI cheat by giving them, like, extra speed. Or kind of in this case, they're letting me cheat a little bit by giving me extra speed because, you know, there's no reason for the AI to be slowing down there. Yeah, just a little bit of a, a computer background of AI technologies there. <laughs> I've been around a long time, guys. I'm an old fart. <laughs> We are in the lead though, we're in first place. Not doing so bad. I really like the, the map, like I said. It reminds me a lot of Utah. I didn't grow up in Utah, but I did grow up in Las Vegas. Took a lot of trips to Utah. My dad grew up in Utah. And uh, Utah is gorgeous. There's so many beautiful, beautiful state parks and national parks in Utah. You definitely need to go there if you can. All right, I think that is all the time that we've got for today, though. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I really do appreciate you being here. Today, I'm planning on releasing this on Halloween Day, so if you're watching this on the day that it releases, I hope you guys have a great Halloween. Get lots of candy. Don't get too much. Uh, don't don't eat so much that you have a stomach ache. But uh, be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys on the flip side later. <laughs> Bye.